So yes, there is a magical concoction that I put on every dog's food while they're here. Um, partially, this is to prevent parasites and spread of illnesses or contagions, viruses, that kind of stuff. So every dog that's here, they get diatomaceous earth and they also get colloidal silver uh, for those two things, for, the, uh, for any parasites or for um, you know stomach bugs, worms, anything like that. They also work really well on uh, heart, it, or diatomaceous earth works really well on just anything that's intestinal gut related. Um, also works really well with if you have fleas and ticks issues, um, which we don't have here in Utah, but if you were to run into that type of situation, you can uh, create a paste or you can create a, you can even do a dust bath with the dog. You just have to work it into their fur so that it, if when they do shake and, and you know, shake off their, their fur and stuff that it doesn't go into the air. Um, so here, I'll just walk you through what, what I have. So this is the colloidal silver solution that I use. I can buy this off of Amazon. Um, it's the ASAP 10, and you wanna make sure that whatever colloidal silver that you're purchasing is 10 ppm. That's just the measurement of the, the, um, the, the silver and the water. Um, so anyway, it says one table or one teaspoon for serving size for humans. Um, I usually go with more of the children's dosages for kids or for, um, for dogs. So quarter to half a teaspoon daily. Uh, I just add this to their food. Okay. So that goes to their food. I, I personally take it. I give it to my kids. I give it to my dogs. Everybody takes it. It's antiviral antibacterial it's awesome helps especially prevent any illnesses colds anything like that so if you start to feel congested or scratchy throat or anything like that take it yourself and you can also give it to your dogs um terra greens this is from doTERRA for the oil company terra greens is just basically fruits and vegetables it basically meets your daily requirement for your veggies and your fruits um, I usually put this in my smoothies and stuff like that, but for the dogs, what I do is I just take a, like, seriously, like a pinch, and I just kind of, like, sprinkle it onto their food. So they get a little bit of that. This, oh, I'll set my phone down for a second, maybe. Uh, it'll do a little bit of finagling here. So basically, it looks like <laughs> it's dehydrated, freeze-dried grass. <laughs> okay, and it tastes like it, too. So... Anyway, I add this to my smoothies and stuff like that. Um, it's got kale and spinach and all sorts of great stuff. It's got alfalfa and great things. Good for you. Okay? Good for the dogs, too. I only do a little bit for the dogs just to add a little bit of, of stuff. This is not what is in the bottle, but or what the, what the uh, container says it is, but I'll show you. This is actually my diatomaceous earth. So, um... The diatomaceous earth, I use this little teeny scoop here, and that's what I give to the dogs. I sprinkle that onto their food, and that helps with any of the parasites and bugs that they might be passing from each other, uh, especially if it's a new dog that has come in from, or hasn't been here in a while, I usually give them that, and I give it to my dogs every couple of days, just to make sure that they don't pick up anything while we're out and about in town. Now, these other products are from a company specifically called Volhard. Volhard. Come on. There we go. Volhard Dog Nutrition. And um, full disclosure, I did become a distributor with them, so I am kind of somewhat biased. But this company um, has been around for a really long time, and I finally decided to become an affiliate with them because I believe in their products. So this is their vitamin B complex. Now this is primarily why I feed it to every dog that comes here. Come on. There we go. So it helps with, I mean, honestly, with, with your doodles and that kind of thing, you might not have excessive shedding issues, but you might have uh, lots of dander issues, okay? So excessive shedding, motion sickness, fleas, flies, any insects and that kind of stuff, cracks around their mouth, dirty decaying teeth, reactions to vaccines, anxiety and stress, um, constipation, hair loss, weight gain, the eating of stools or you know poop eating, 
uh, any premature uh, graying and any umbilical sores. So basically anything around their stomach that might be, um, any anything around their abdomen that might be flaring up like an allergy or rash or something like that. So anyway, I absolutely love vitamin B complex. I give it to every dog that's here because it helps with so many different um, ailments, as you can see. So that just comes in a little, let's see if I can open this again just comes like this. It's a powder form. This does need to be refrigerated. And it just has a teeny little scoop. And you just sprinkle that onto the dog's food, add water, and you're good to go. Okay, this is kind of like a probiotic basically. So that's what I use. Okay, and now this one is digestive enzymes. This is definitely a probiotic. However, I only give this one to dogs who have severe bowel issues. So like for instance, if your dog is having uh, diarrhea or vomiting or just an upset tummy, constipation, anything like that, they need to get on a probiotic and digestive enzymes from Volhard is the, the product I would go for. Okay, so that one is only, I only keep that here for dogs who are susceptible to having like an upset tummy so or they get um if they get anxious and it causes an upset tummy i go to vitamin b if they have a like a digestive issue or they have like uh, a, f a gut issue uh, sensitivity to food changes and stuff like that then i go for digestive enzymes so stress anxiety related diet gut related got it okay so both of those have to be refrigerated because they're both probiotics. Um, this is krill oil, and it's in this little plastic bag because it is it is messy. It gets all over the place. So krill oil is just like your you know salmon oil, fish oil, whatever, but it is so much more better and concentrated. And this is specifically made for dogs. It is also good for cats. So cats and dogs can take this. You literally just squirt, you know, one one to two pumps onto your dog's food. It has all the measurements, like the, the serving size. There we go. So anyway, I don't give that to every dog. That's usually just for my own dogs. Um, this one, if you're feeding kibble, like dry dog food, this needs to be added. Okay. And I don't say that lightly because not I'm not just a salesperson, obviously. Um, this is everything that your dog needs nutrition-wise that is cooked out of their kibble, okay? When, when the manufacturers make all of their dry dog food, um, all of those, all of this good stuff here, vitamins, minerals, supplements that the dog food claims to have in it is actually cooked out of the bag of food, okay? So if you're feeding dry dog food, which most of you guys are, um, then you need to f supplement with this. This is called Endurance by Volhard Dog Nutrition. Okay, you can see what is included in it. Sorry, my camera isn't focusing very well. There we go. Take a screenshot if you want to. And then um, gives you the serving sizes, what you need to do to how to, how to, um, how to serve it, put it in the, sprinkle it over the food, add water, let it sit on the counter for a few minutes and then stir it around. Um, always keep refrigerated after opening because this actually already has some of the, some of the digestive enzyme in it, okay? So uh, I feed this to my own personal dogs and I usually add it to any other dogs that are here just for taste. They love it. It's great. It adds an, an it, it adds all of those vitamins and minerals to their food. It does make a huge difference um, that I've seen with dogs who are picky, who don't like their food, who are uh, finicky eaters, who um, you know they'll eat a little bit of it and they'll leave some behind in their food, or they just have issues with their gut. Get them on endurance get them on the digestive enzymes, or if it's an anxiety related thing, put them on vitamin B complex, um, help them clear out their gut with some colloidal silver and, and diatomaceous earth. And then you can add fruits. I mean, this is more of like an optional thing. Yeah. So anyway, there you go. That's
that's my magic recipe that I add to my kid, my kids. Wow. <laughs> add to my dogs, uh, add to their food. So yeah.